Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Starlord and today we're gonna be taking a look at another little update video for Pokemon Brick Bronze. Now some of you guys may already know this as it was tweeted out maybe about two days ago, but I have been very busy on a special secret kind of project thing. Uh, which you guys are gonna love. I know you are. Uh, but anyway guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a like as it does help me out more than you realize. And if you are new here, then look, make sure to subscribe for more Pokemon Brick Bonds videos, news, guides, giveaways, all that kind of stuff. Um, okay, so uh, we actually got a little leak from T Bradem, who is the owner of Pokemon Brick Bronze, and uh, yeah, he actually leaked out the next route at what it looks like, and I have to admit, it looks pretty awesome. Um, looks very blank in some kind of areas to me personally, but I guess like you know they're gonna change up one or two things when the official game comes out or the official update even. Uh, but getting into the tweet right now that it is on screen, you see that Brad actually actually says, um, y'all ready to shred some gnar, so like gnarly, like, you know, gnarly man, like, that's kind of like how they say things, I guess, when they skateboard, or surf, or snowboard, I guess, I'm not from America, so I don't really know, uh, but it is a big word in America, and uh, if we just play the clip right now, uh, you will see that he is actually snowboarding down the, down the Alps, on his little hoverboard and it looks absolutely crazy and uh, yeah it looks like we've got these like kind of little jump pads that you can kind of do little tricks on i'm assuming that the tricks are always going to be the same on this on the certain like kind of jump pads so i can imagine that that would kind of get boring a little bit fast for people um but other than that it looks like there's some kind of like race kind of scheme going on maybe there might be like a leaderboard for the fastest time making it down to the you know to the end of the the thing or something i don't really know it'd be cool if they did that though um but as you get halfway down to the mountain you start to see that the snow has started to melt and uh, you know it's not at the same altitude as frostvale city anymore it's it's you know it's way further down and uh, yeah then it goes into the green grass that we all know and love and this means that there will be normal type pokemon there you know like kind of like grass type bug type uh, all that kind of stuff in those little uh, bits of grass at the bottom now, um, I can't really show you it in today's video, but I did kind of pause it a little bit at certain areas, and uh, there is maybe about four turnoffs on this route, so there's like four different exits that you can go through, maybe even more, um, but what we do know is that there will be a secret little entrance somewhere, there will also be uh, the Roria League, which is the Elite Four, there will be an entrance to the actual, uh, you know, the Elite Four in this area. Whether or not we'll actually be able to go and see it, I don't really know. Whether or not it's going to be in under construction, we don't know either. But uh, at least we know that there is going to be multiple ways you can go through this route. And uh, my theory is that there's going to be maybe about three legendary Pokemon, maybe four, uh, or three legends, one mythical, and uh, that would just be kind of cool, but uh, yeah, guys, that was pretty much it for the little leak, I guess. I'm very excited to kind of get on my hoverboard and put it to more use. I wish there was more higher jumps and everything. That would have been really cool if they went really high, uh, but you know, it's whatever. Uh, tell me what you're most excited for, guys. The Roria League, the snowboarding, the new po uh, pocket monsters, the, mo the, the new Pokemon that we're going to be able to catch or, you know, just kind of getting through the story. Or Surf, I guess. I don't really know. I never really got to see anywhere that you could use Surf there, which is kind of strange, too. So, yeah. Um, I guess there's just a lot of places we can surf back in the pre-game content, I guess. Uh, well, anyway, guys, I hope that you have a fantastic day, and until next time, I've been Star-Lord. Oh, see you.